Attention, please. An emergency has been reported in this building. While this report is being verified, please proceed to the corridor outside the nearest fire exit and stand by for further instructions. Do not enter the Wait, fire exit. The Do building? not use the elevator. Emergency has been reported in this building. Okay. While this report is being verified, please proceed to the Talk corridor the outside the nearest fire exit and stand by for further instructions. Do not enter the fire exit. Do not use so the elevator. Attention, please. Okay. Emergators. Going in the bed. Attention, please. An emergency okay. has been reported okay. in this Ooh. building. While this report is being verified, please proceed to the corridor outside the nearest fire exit and stand by for further instructions. Do not enter the fire exit. Do not use the elevators. Attention, please. An emergency has been... While this report is being verified, please proceed to the corridor outside the nearest fire exit and stand by for further instructions. Do not enter the fire exit. Proceed to the corridor outside the nearest fire exit and stand by for further instructions. Do not enter the fire exit. Do not use the elevators. Attention, please. An emergency has been reported in this building. Do not enter the fire exit. Do not use the elevators. Attention, please. An emergency has been reported in this building. While this report is being verified. All right, so we evacuated the building, but just as we got to the ground floor, the danger actually subsided. It doesn't look like there was anything, but there are three fire trucks. I don't know exactly what happened, but we got our cats and ourselves out, and it was a good, um, it was a good run through in case there was actually a real emergency. Bags are working great. Got lots of compliments on them. Not that like that's the reason we got them. We got these bags because. Their backpacks, so it allows us to each carry a cat and have a bag of emergency stuff so that we can get out fast with our go bags if we need to. Um, but these are nice because the cats get little bubbles they can look out and it makes them look like little astronauts, so that's pretty cool. And they're terrified, but I think they could get used to this and beautiful out here. It's actually nice. It's not too cold. You're such a good boy, Tuck. Good boy. Hey, buddy. Hey, you. He's scared. I think they like these a lot more than the um, traditional like hard carriers. And We had um, Sherpa bags before, which are like soft rectangular carriers and um, I never liked them because it's like an over-the-shoulder bag, so it's, they A, sit here and whenever you walk they're swinging, um, and you're trying to hold one bag and then have another bag of stuff and it's just like, it's like hard to hold everything. Uh, these are much easier because it's a backpack, so you just throw it on your back and um, then your arms are free to carry other stuff. So that's what we got. It's called the Texans Innovative Travel Bubble Backpack Cat Carrier for Cats and Dogs. <laughs> but as you can see, it was very, very useful to get out of the apartment very quickly. Hi. I think she actually likes being outside. Hi. Good girl. Hey, Tux, how you doing? Are you freaking out? Aww. We should bring them out here more often so they get used to it. A little more used to it. Threw one of her like little toys in here at last minute, but we should have something like a toy and like some catnip so that they feel a little more comfortable. They have something that smells like them, um, and I think we should have like a couple cans of food and treats for the cats too, just in case we get stuck somewhere. Oh, <laughs> the kitty spacecraft! Yeah. <laughs> the little explorers. Yeah. <laughs> that is too cute. <laughs> <laughs> She's only seen a dog like maybe twice. <laughs> oh, he you, he doesn't understand that the cats actually don't like him. <laughs> yeah. 
he thinks he thinks they want to play and I'm like no they want to kill you <laughs> <laughs> that's not that. exactly a game <laughs> Aww, <they're> very cute. <laughs> thank you <laughs> have a good one thank you too. so I guess this is an impromptu review of the cat backpack that we were using so obviously you know, in cases of emergency, just like this one where we just needed to like get out. It was so easy to put the cats into the bag. You've got this great big opening that opens up here and the bubble thing comes off as well, just so that to, you know, depending on whether the cat likes to stick their head out there. We've got vents over here for the cats to look out of, vents down here, vents up there, vents on the other side. The really cool thing is how easy it is just to lift up <laughs> All right, it's as easy as putting on a bag. Just like that. It's really comfortable to wear. I mean, it's all easier than wearing, than carrying those hard cat cases. And I feel like the cats enjoy it a lot better. And I'm just gonna slip into my As you can see, Seven loves being in this thing. Timmy! So what do you think about this bag in comparison to our old, like traditional hard case cat carrier? Our old, our old um, carriers sucked. I mean, they were, um, they were heavy and hard to handle and the cats didn't like them and it was always so hard to get them into them and these are so easy and so cute and they're better in every way. I mean, it's a good thing that it's warm and it's actually kind of beautiful out. You look at the sunset? Yeah, I'm looking. So apparently it's a false alarm, so we're going back in. But all in all, yeah, the, and the cats are cold. But all in all, I think it was a success. A really weird, impromptu test on the bag. Going back home. Going back home.